Okay, Mr. Simpson, you're set up in a pretty good spot here. Early in the fall. Cats. You know, today we're using cut suckers, and, it, and it's working just fine, but they can be real bait selective. It's a good idea to bring, bring crawlers with you this time of year. If you can get your hands on some frogs, those frogs are making their way into hibernation, and that could be a great bait as well. So we're just using a, a sucker. We cut it a sucker into thirds, working perfect for us today, and having a blast with these kitty cats. They're tough, aren't they? They are, they yeah, bulldog. I know. Yeah. I know, you get an eight, nine pounder and definitely they'll get your attention. That's a nice one now. Come here. Mr. Simpson's really came on at the latter part of the day catching whoppers. One really cool feature that I have in this Hummingbird Helix 10 is the auto chart live feature. You know, many rivers, and you know, moderate and even smaller rivers are unmapped. And what I can do with this is I put in a zero lines SD card in here and I'm recording successive passes on this river. So every time I come here, I put the card back in and make more details every time I come. But it's sort of nice in the fact that in a short order, I have a really accurate map. Not only that, it has a lot of alternate features like a water level offset. This river fluctuates five to 60 feet, you know, seasonally. So what I can do is go in there and adjust the map and it's accurate based on the water conditions I happen to be fish, fishing. Right now it's relatively low fall conditions. Come back here in spring at the water levels five foot higher, I can go on my map and in accurate, I can put that water level, level offset, raise it four, five feet and it's accurate. And the interesting thing is, is I can actually do this moving pretty quickly. Actually, I can get the boat moving to about 25, 30 miles an hour and be accurately mapping the river. You can see I made one pass down here. I've actually went around this hole, which we caught a couple of cats in. But you can see actually how it's populating as I'm moving along. The cool thing is, is I can actually move at a pretty good rate of speed in garner this accurate map, you'll see, but what I'm gonna do is actually get off the track of that I've already made so I get the next pass. We'll get her up on plane and you'll see what I mean. It's, you can see while I'm positioning my boat a little bit over from the pass that I came on down river, so I'm updating and mapping more of the river on each successive pass. right day, catch lots and lots of them. You know, a lot of people always ask me if, if I hunt. <laughs> you know what I tell them? What? I hunt for fish. That's, That's right. it.